is NF Awareness Month. It's a genetic disorder. It affects people in a lot of different ways. Ashley Smith introduces us to a Sharonville girl living with that disease and how you can get involved in a fundraiser for her next weekend. If you want to be silly, do something. Neurofibromatosis, or NF, is a genetic disorder affecting the nervous system in one out of 3,000 people. Tumors appear on the nerves of a patient and can show up as spots on their skin or they are simply invisible. I always say that we have a punch card at Children's, but that being said, we are so fortunate to have them right down the road. Ann Cox learned her daughter, three-year-old Vivian, had NF just before her first birthday. That's when an MRI at Cincinnati Children's Hospital revealed an optic tumor near her eye. So far, Vivian is handling the disorder well, but time will tell how this could impact her health. Our prayer is that it's happy and healthy, but at the same time, we don't know what the future holds. So, yes, it's a lot. It's a, with this it's genetic a disorder, it's a lot with, there's so much unknown. Vivian loves to ride her bike, play soccer, play with her dog and older brother. She loves to dance. My dog dance. Father daughter dance. You did? Mm -hmm. What do you do with your brother? Do you guys play together? Yeah. I play outside where I play. She got to sing in a musical at her school recently. This summer, Vivian will have her 11th MRI. You just want your kid to be okay. And having the support, it's really good to talk to other people that have the same issues and concerns. Because, I mean, you can read about it a lot, but, you know, when you meet people that actually have other children or they actually have it, and you see how they cope with it and deal with it. So, Bobby and Ann Cox hope that through more research and funding, they can find a cure for NF. Now, here are the details about the walk coming up next weekend. It's called Shine a Light NF Walk. It is Saturday, June 3rd, beginning at 830. That's when you can register. It runs all the way until 2 p.m. It's going to be in Mason at Corwin M. Nixon Park. The walk will start at 10 a.m. and then family fun activities will continue from 11 a.m. until 1 p.m. Now, if you would like to register for this walk, we have a link at fox19.com. And of course, you can find out more about Vivian's story there as well. Ashley Smith, Fox 19 Now.